Hi, Gabby. Hi. What would you like to work on? Um, I'd quite like to work on my um, bipolar disorder um, and my um, borderline personality disorder as well. Okay, and how does having those two disorders make you feel? Uh, frustrated, um, quite lonely, um, and very ashamed. Okay, and on a scale of one to ten, can you rate those emotions, mm -hmm. ten being the highest? Um, my ashamed is probably a 10 and then frustration and loneliness are probably about a 9. Okay, all right. And when you feel into those emotions, where do you feel tension in your body? Everywhere. It just feels like it radiates from top to bottom. Got it. Okay. All right. So I want you to feel into those emotions. I know it sounds counter intuitive right or counterproductive but a way to feel into the frustration feel into the shame feel into the loneliness okay and just stay there okay yeah. All right.
Okay, Gabby, how does that feel now? I would say about like maybe a seven. Okay, the frustration is, where would you rate the frustration? Uh, seven. seven. Where would you rate the loneliness right now? Uh, maybe a six. Okay, and where would you rate the shame right now? Uh, probably about an eight. Okay, all right. Let's, let's do, let's focus on one emotion at a time, okay? Mm -hmm. Let's do frustration first, okay? Thank <laughs> you. 
Okay. How is the frustration now? Mm -hmm. About five. All right. Let's keep going. Mm -hmm. The frustration. Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> okay, how does that feel now? Three. Okay, good. Three. Okay, let's move on to the next emotion. We can circle back round, okay? Mm -hmm. Okay, so let's go to uh, loneliness. Okay, so I want you to rate your loneliness right now. Maybe six. six. Okay, I want you to lean into that, feel into loneliness, okay? Just stay there.
Okay, Gabby, can you rate your loneliness now? Uh, what is that, five? Five, okay. Yeah. Right. Keep leaning into that loneliness. about now? Probably about a three. Okay. Let's move on to shame. Okay. And we can mm -hmm. back around. Okay. Yep. All right. Uh, can you rate your shame right now, please? An eight. Eight. Okay. All right. So feel into that. Keep, put all your yeah. focus on feeling that. Okay. And stay there. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, 
How does that feel now? Maybe a seven. Okay. Lean into seven, okay? Okay, how's that feel now, Gabby? A five. Okay, all right, lean into that five, okay? Four. Lean into that four. Thank you. 
Okay, right now? Two. Good. <clears throat> okay, so now I'd like you to think about um, the borderline personality and bipolar disorder. What comes up now if you think about those two things? Um. There's still some lingering negatives, uh -huh. but they're not as overwhelming. Good. Not as um, okay. Um, and my brain doesn't feel quite as cluttered. Good. So do you feel like some space has opened up? Yeah. Some space has opened up. Good. It feels more spacious. Does it feel lighter? Not necessarily lighter, but definitely open is the right word that describes it the best. It feels less like I can get a straight thought out and I can understand that thought and I can think about that thought without having everything feeling like it's over the overlapping over the top of each other, if that makes any sense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So if you clump frustration and shame and loneliness together, right, in a ball, where would you rate those emotions now, just as one? Probably say a two, definitely. Good, good, okay. All right, let's go back to, you said there were some negatives. What were the negatives? Um, some lingering words that kind of are sticking out a little bit about my about it. Um, can you share those words with me? Yeah, um, pathetic that that's still lingering in my brain. Um, and Um, hatred is a strong one that's still kind of bouncing around in there um, not as isn't they're not when I, I can't when I see them they don't feel like they're big words anymore yeah. they feel like they're slightly smaller but they're still kind of there yeah. if that makes much sense to all that Got it. Okay. So let's, let's take pathetic. Okay. So <clears throat> let's see how loud is that word? How vibrant is that word? How big is that word percentage wise is 10 hundred thousands, one, two, three thousand percent. We want to reduce 3000 down to zero minus infinity to the power of minus infinity and beyond. Right. We're going to clear that from the cerebellum in your brain. Clear that from your liver, spleen, Large intestine, small intestine. Left adrenal, clear from your left kidney and the area of your left ovary. Let's clear that from your lymphatic system and clear it from your immune system. 
see when else when you started feeling pathetic or started hearing pathetic or absorbing that okay what's your age right now 27 okay let's see conception first second third trimester let's delete that from when you were in the third trimester in the womb uh, days, weeks, months, years, one, two, three years old, delete, four, five, delete, six, delete, seven, delete, eight, nine, ten, delete, eleven, twelve, thirty, forty, fifteen, 12, 30, 40, 15, delete, 16, delete, 17, delete, 18, 19, 20, delete, 21, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, delete. Let's pull 27 to 100 into the so-called future and strengthen you to any possible potential future events that may be contributing to feeling pathetic, okay? Let's also clear your judgments of yourself whether you judge yourself or not you should be nice and strong whether you criticize yourself or not you should be nice and strong whether you shame yourself or not you should be nice and strong okay how does that feel now better definitely better Good. not again it's it feels like it's shrunk again Good. all right let's take the word hatred yeah yeah all right, let's see. How big is that? How thick is that? How deep is that? How loud is that? 10, 100,000, 10, 100 millions, one, two, three. Million percent, let's reduce that down to zero minus infinity to the power of minus infinity and beyond. Let's clear that from your gallbladder, spleen, large intestine, small intestine, left kidney, uterus, Endocrine system, digestive system, immune system, from your throat chakra, from your ninth chakra, from your twelfth chakra, from your fifth subtle body, and from your seventh subtle body. And let's see when you started feeling that, absorbing that, taking that on in your life, conception, first, second, third. Days, weeks, months, years, one, two, three, four, five years old, delete hatred from your five year old self, nine, 10, 13, 14, 20, 23, four, five, six, 23, four, five, six, seven, delete, 100. Okay, how does that feel now? Definitely much better. 